Ever pondered setting up a development environment for React? Well, wonder no more. Today, we'll unravel the process, unraveling each step with the detail it deserves. First things first, you need to install Node.js and NPM. Node.js is a JavaScript runtime environment that lets you run JavaScript code outside a browser. NPM, or Node Package Manager, is a package manager for Node.js, helping you install and manage dependencies for your projects. To get these tools, head over to the official Node.js website and download the latest long-term support version suitable for your operating system. Once you follow the installation instructions, Node.js and NPM will be installed on your system, with NPM coming along as part of the Node.js installation. The next step involves installing Create React App. This tool, built by Facebook, allows for quick setting up of new React projects. It provides a pre-configured environment stuffed with all the necessary tools and configurations to kickstart your React development. To install Create React App, open your terminal or command prompt. Run the command npm install g create react app. This command installs create react app globally on your system, enabling you to use it from any directory. With create react app installed, you're now set to create a new react project. Run the command npx create react app my react app in your terminal. Here my react app should be replaced with the name you desire for your project. This command will create a new directory with your chosen project name and a basic React project structure. After creating your project, navigate into the project directory using the terminal with cd my react app. Start the development server by running the command npm start. This command fires up the development server and opens your default web browser to display your React application. For writing your React code, You'll need a code editor or integrated development environment, IDE. Popular choices include Visual Studio Code, Atom, and Sublime Text. Make sure to install any necessary plugins or extensions for React development in your chosen editor. Optionally, if you're planning to use version control with Git, ensure Git is installed on your system. You can download and install Git from its official website. Initialize a Git repository in your project directory if you wish to track changes and collaborate with others. And that's it. You've successfully set up a React development environment. Now you're ready to dive in and start building React applications and playing around with React components. Remember, practice makes perfect. So get coding and have fun.